Howdy, cowdies. Hope you're going good. It's been crazy busy here this week. I think Monday, I think we did like three house calls. Like what the hell? Anyway, heaps of good stuff. Heaps of good stuff. Love a little pair of sterling silver cased salt and peps. More little sterling salt pots. More little sort of, I don't know, little toiletry bottles there with a the sterling top. Lovely sterling silver little tea set over the back, which is really kind of quite like it, standing on the three feet. Just with that single little band around the centre of each piece. All hallmarks. A couple of nice little gold rings look to be there. Nice old watch keys. More silver spoons. Uh, membership horse racing stuff. Got some great banknotes, all in mint condition. Consecutive $5 notes, consecutive $2 notes. Sterling silver little sort of coffee can holders. Little Goebel set of three Goebel's poodles there from the 1950s. A cute German stuff. More nice jewellery. Lovely sort of Victorian morning brooch there. Little brownie downing dish. More bits of silver, teaspoons and a napkin ring. This little jade horse, little carved jade horse is quite nice. Sterling silver christening mug over the back, just needs a polish. Some lovely things in a little jewellery cabinet this week. I've got heaps of other cool stuff as well. This Art Deco sort of lighthouse lamp. Very cool. Just need to shade on top. But very cool. It's got like a line up the front of it all as well there. We'll switch on the bottom. Nice thing. Little matches a little deco table next to it. And some deco smoker stands and a lamp. And a little sort of deco telephone table. It's the deco section. <laughs> nice little oak two drawer filer. This thing's pretty wacky. This Calaro tape transcriptor. There you go. Wacky thing. Reel to reel up on top. All the switches and everything in the front. Speakers down the bottom. It's again, sort of nice deco shape to it. Kind of like this. Old cowrie pine chest of drawers that's been painted green back in 1978. And whoever had it was into some pretty cool music. Including good old Big Charlie. Pretty cool old Melbourne funk band. They had some great stuff. Nice little deco U-shaped table. I really like this little Victorian table actually. A little sort of tilt top wine table there with the ball and claw feet. A nice big frame chromo lithograph there in the gilt frame. Pretty cool Sex Pistols poster. Anarchy in the UK tour. Sex Pistols, The Damned, Johnny in the Johnny Thunders, Heartbreakers. A good old clash. Cool little lot. Got some really nice clothes this week. Nice little Phillips turntable. Got some great clothes. Nice little sort of oriental sort of little corset top with a nice little velvet jacket. Some cool old Hawaiian shirts. Ladies stuff, more Hawaiian shirts. Oh, the other ones are up being photographed at the moment. We've got all these grantastic 1970s t-shirts. I think you've got Frank Zappa Australian Tour 76. There's a Fonzie shirt. I'll show you them in a minute. They're fantastic. Uh, golf clubs. Photography gear over the back there. Edger. We've actually put that lawn edger with a bottle, of, a bottle of champagne so you can celebrate after you've finished. Radios, transistors, light shades, lamps, stereo system there. Nice old Kenwood one from the 80s, 90s. Little collection of lamps and candlesticks up the top. Heaps of furniture again. Nice little pair of bedsides and the galvanised baby's bath. Little Edwardian nurse's chair. Nice little bookshelf and little kangaroo back there. Trunks and things. Big lot of ladies' clothes and sort of dress-up stuff down there. Once again, balloon backs and bentwoods and big picture frames and all sorts of furniture. Some lovely ladies' vintage clothing as well this week. Nice high backs, arts and crafts, oak. Another nice little pair of gilt frame chromo lithos down there. Cool old sort of goods trolley with some boxes and stuff to go with it. Bass guitar in the amp, nice big lot of books. Kind of like this little retro sort of office chair is pretty cool. And there's a really nice little um, shelving, little sort of garagey tool, little unity thing there. Here's a little cutie as well. Italian white vinyl sort of little fold-out chaise thing. Nice little riding box. Set of four Victorian cedar balloon backs. Lovely sort of deco sideboard cocktail cabinet with all the sort of lift-up top and everything. 
some interesting nice light shades and some Bakelite and old transistor radios and nice little collection of clocks and things and a bullwhip. Kitchen alia and a tease made. Big lot of EP and S up the top there. It's a cracker of a picture this. Ernest Dardé, English artist, painted about 1917-1918. Funnily enough, the title is An Incident Between a German Submarine and William Verrill's Fishing Cob off Staithes in England. There you go. If you look, there's actually a little book written all about it, about the actual incident. Can't see the submarine in the picture, but there's William Verrill's Fishing Cob. It's a nice thing, this beautiful frame that it's in, eh? Lovely picture. A couple of nice clocks and the cuckoo works. It's been going all day. Lovely deco dining suite there, the sort of table with a sort of pedestal, twin pedestal base, all the chairs with the solid backs on them. Nice little little nipper, HMV little nipper radio we've put with a cute little Smith's clock. With a nice old wooden clock and this little 80s perspex ones are ever. Woohoo, we've got a pair of silver balls. Everyone gets excited over them. You can watch on Thursday night. A couple of cool block mounted posters. Nice big lots of crystal and Bakelite. More Bakelite here. Oriental stuff, nice big lot of um, Copeland Spokes Tower is the name of the pattern, the blue and white there. All the serving china, it's all a little bit damaged unfortunately. And it's nice early stuff. Victorian little tea set, cutlery, more pretty china. Cartonware, nice big collection of EP, nice little deco Bakelite lamp. It's got a little bit of damage on it here and there. This is pretty cool, the old cream can there marked A. Joyce & Co. Makers in Melbourne. That's a lovely little, um, what's this little thing on the ground you're photographing, Vanessa? Uh, Victorian. That's blouse. what, about 1850 or 1860, a bit later? Yeah. Yeah, little blouse, lovely little thing. Yep, would have right. had a bustle skirt with it. There you go, bustle the skirt up. Heaps of cool stuff this week, guys. Lovely lots of EP and S and some more Don Shields and Victorian hand-painted porcelain. This is sterling silver, all these salt pots, we'll move them into the end cabinet in a minute. Uh, this is pretty cool. Piano aid. Play with one finger because one finger does the work of five. <laughs> Put it with a nice little radio. AGE, Australian General Electric. A couple of interesting bits of pottery. Love a little hand painted landscape plate. Interesting little hand coloured photograph there. We've put with a couple of nice little fashion engravings. Italian pussycats are cute. That's that big Lalique plate there, isn't it, Van? Yes. Well, we need to get water that. Lily. What, what's it called? Water Lily, is it? Water. All right, we'll put him in the end cabinet in a minute. More nice 70s stuff. Love the little self-raising flower box and the chip. Potato french fry cutter box with both with the cool images on the boxes. Nice little retro set of canisters. Some more retro ceramics. Nice radio. Art Deco Bakelite. Another big collection of the Copeland Spokes Tower Blue and White. She's cool. Little doorstop. She's all quite heavy and weighted with the handle on top. Lovely Victorian silk shawl down the bottom there. Still nice and colourful. Some nice stuff. Lovely old Ansonia clock. Shaving mirror is quite sweet. Lovely little Bakelite Art Deco lamp base there with a frilly shade on it. Little religious icon. Little sort of pressed leather picture. Beautiful frame. Couple of trios. Nice bit of jacket. Lovely little sort of writing desk stand. Beautiful little lot. Some Shelley, unusual little Wembley ashtray there with a kangaroo sort of leaping through the Australian bush. Here's nice, the Wirren plate there. Another bit of Dalton. I got some nice stuff at the top shelf. Lovely little ginger beer bottle there, Mangarone O'Neill Echuca, made by Fowler Pottery. Lovely big ornate sterling silver three piece tea set. Beautiful thing. Really like the little plated Epern as well. It's got all the trumpets in it. You got a pair of George V tulip shaped sterling silver vases, they're really cute. Nice bit of remude and a nice bit of jacket. Eh, it's gonna be a cracker of a sale this week. Big bit of the leaks lovely there as well. It's gonna be a good sale. Oh quickly I'll show you some more clothes. These are the t-shirts. Original 70s Levi's one. This thing's cool, long sleeve thing. Original 70s Che Guevara shirt. There you go, made in Portugal on the label. Love pack, real 70s. Hey, the funds, yeah. 
What else? Frank Zappa, Australian, two of 76. A couple of really cool 1970s Channel 9 South Australia shirts. First in South Australia. Really cool bits. And these are some lovely clothes as well, all the ladies' stuff. Lovely astrakhan coat. Teeth frocks, I've been told. Don't, geez, don't forget the 1930s teeth frocks. Victoria. That's them there. And one thing at a time, Vanessa. I know. Crikey. She's excited. <laughs> they are great, actually. Fantastic lot of ladies' clothes this week, as well as the gent stuff as well. So, anyway, hopefully you saw something you liked. You know that I don't really give a rat's if you did or if you didn't. <laughs> See you on Thursday night.